Um, my name's Rachel. I'm from North Tonawanda and I'm 16. My life before MST was a little hectic and crazy. Rachel was out of control. She did not follow the house rules. She decided that she could do what she felt like it when she felt like it. I wasn't going to school at the time. I did get bullied a lot. I would skip and I would ditch and I wouldn't listen to my mom. We fought constantly. My house was destroyed. I would basically just do whatever I want. Didn't care what my mom had to say about it. She was leaving a lot in the middle of the night and Jessica didn't really know where she was going. I tried going the natural routes of grounding, trying to keep her in the house and she'd just sneak out. Jessica really felt like she lost control of Rachel and she really wanted to gain that control back of her. And that's through our work at MST, we helped her regain that control back. MST is multi-systemic therapy. It is a therapy that is evidence-based that we use with the families. It follows um, an analytical model. The Department of Social Services continues to support MST because it works. We've been doing MST with Catholic Charities for 20 years. One of the ways that we do engage families is coming to them. I have two other children, so my house gets a little hectic. Did it around my schedule and what was easiest for me. We also have 24-7 on-call, and we really feel that families are the experts uh, when it comes to their children and their own families, and we're the expert in behaviors. So we look at it as a great partnership. When I think of MST, I think of help with knowledge, I guess, giving you the knowledge and tools that you need to be a successful parent with a child that has you know, behavioral needs. We were able to target Rachel's behavior at every level. We were able to do on a school level, on a community level, and a home level. My MST counselor, she told me that the decisions that I was making, they weren't just affecting me, they were affecting everybody else around me. She gave me a lot of advice and she gave me tools that would help me. It wasn't sugar-coated to either me or Rachel. It was straightforward honesty. We would talk about the things that would could possibly happen like at school or like outside of school that might trigger me into making um, bad decisions. She was able to get into another school, you know, because she knew as well as I did that she wasn't going to be a productive member of society if she stayed in the school that she was in. When I went to the high school before MSC, I literally had a 14 average. Like, I never went to school. And now I have all these skills and tools that I know how to use now because of MST and my counselor. I'm, I'm like, doing really good in school. Like, I have high 80s and 90s. Like, I have a job now. It not only keeps families together, but it saves the taxpayers a lot of money. One child placed in residential placement can cost 100000 a year. It's been one of the more successful preventive programs that I've been involved with in the last 32 years here at the department. This has stayed the test of time. I recommended MST to parents that I know that are, were going through what I had went through because I knew that MST worked. If I didn't have like the counseling that I did and like the tools that I was given, I would either be in a hospital or a detention center. The difference is, is that we're healed. I, I guess that's the best thing is we were broken and I thought beyond repair. I was able to put us back together because of the tools that I got. We've gone through a lot and we've come out on top and MSD has helped us along the way.